not prepared for this. Wait, I'll get you. I'll get you. If you remember back in the last shenanigans episode, I was getting chased by homing carrots. Well, in this episode, I've decided to take that fight to them, which I experimented with a little bit in that episode, and well, we all know how that went, especially when I blew up my car with an atomic spud gun. And if you take a closer look at this, you'll see it wasn't even worth it because the carrots survived the explosion. So today I've decided to experiment some more with different spud guns and see which one is the most efficient against homing carrots. But first, it's time to announce the results of the mystery close-up contest from the last video. So here was the close-up image. And if you guessed the vent hood, you are correct. And the winning contestant is... Vincent Prue. I hope I pronounced that correctly. With his entry of the range hood, which is the same thing, I reached out to Vincent and he has decided he wants his pin gun video to be shown here today, so here we go. It's a very short video, so I'm going to play it twice here and then I'm going to spice it up just a little bit. It may look like an ordinary pin on the outside, but inside it's the almighty Pen Gun 3000. The Pen Gun 3000. Get them while supplies last. It may not be suitable for young children. All right, everyone, and I am now in another bad hiding spot. If I were actually hiding in this spot, you would be able to see me right away. So again, I am in plain sight and I am in the giant kitchen. So what I mean by in plain sight is that right here, I've got my spawn pad. If you were to spawn here, just kind of fly upward very right quick and start looking around the kitchen like last time I was up there on the vent hood, then you would be able to just look around and go, oh, there you are. Uh, other places I could be in plain sight is if you were to just kind of fly over here and you know, maybe look down there on the floor and see me right away or something like that. You don't have to like get inside anything. Like I, uh, I wouldn't have to, you know, get behind a cabinet or in this cup over here or something. See, this would not be in plain sight, so I'm not talking about that. But I am in plain sight. I'm in the giant kitchen. Post in the comments down below. And also let me know how you'd like to be recognized. If you just want to be recognized as a winner with your name on the screen. If you want to have your channel featured on here. And for a channel feature, I would simply come to your channel. I put it on the screen like this and say, all right, check out, you know, channel Zeradox, for example. He's got gaming videos. He's got uh, mod spotlight videos. Check it out here or something like that. Now, if you would like one of your specific videos, a section uh, about 30 seconds long or so to be shown and uh, let me know in the comments whenever you post your guess all right so let me know where you think this is down in the comments below first person to get it right or at least the closest will be the winner so let's see who can figure this one out so back in the uh, shenanigans video this is what i was getting shot by it is a homing carrot launcher now my friend travis was actually shooting me with these but today i've got this wired to the uh, repeater here with the timer on it. It's gonna shoot every 10 seconds. And I've got a wireless gate on top that is linked to uh, a wireless gate in this truck that I'm going to be shooting the uh, carrots down with, or at least attempting to do so. Now I did make this originally so that someone could drive and someone else could sit in the back and shoot, but as it is, I don't have another person here to go along with me, so. I have just made this one uh, hooked up here so that I can shoot and drive at the same time. This is being made possible by this baby right here. This is the Simple View Angle Controller. And how it works is, however the camera is facing, it tries to face the same direction. So, But I've got the seat connected to it here, and that makes it so that only when I'm in the seat does it actually move. This is actually the Spud Minigun from the More Spud Guns mod. And then if I hop in here, you can see that it snaps to my camera's rotation, however I move the camera. Now I've also got an external app called X Mouse Button Controls. If I press the scroll lock key right now, I can actually use my mouse. Mouse button number one is mapped to number one in this case. And number two is mapped to my right mouse button. So when I hit that, it will trigger that wireless gate right down there that you can't hardly see and we'll trigger that wireless gate to start shooting carrots. And the way it works is it's it's color based, so they're not painted, so they're directly connected. So every time I spawn a new truck, because I'm probably gonna do it a few times, 
then it's automatically already connected to it. I don't have to worry about that. And I've also uh, added a few more things under here, as you can see. Here's some explosives to make things a little more interesting. This thing actually doesn't do anything, it's just for looks. The real engine is under here. All right, so let's uh, let's give this a little try here. Hit right mouse button to turn that on. And here comes the first one. Oh, I need to get away here. I should have gone a little further. Okay, here we go. These, as you can see, these don't actually destroy the carrots. They just deflect them. But if I deflect them into the ground, then I'm, then I'm good to go. Oh, I got two of them now. Oh, that was close. That was a really close one. Here comes another carrot. It's going to launch them at me every 10 seconds. There's another one. Whoa! Oh, that one took off a wheel. Oh, I got one wheel down. Now things get interesting. Oh, I am really slow now. Come on, can't you hit me? Oh, I turned too far. Oh, no, no. This is going to be tough. Hey, hey. Outsmarted you this time. Well, this is not what I, how I planned for this to go. I'm just over there blowing my truck up. Spawn another truck here. And we'll just give this another try. What? What? Spare rocket came from nowhere. Eh. I also have to be careful because I can actually shoot this glass right off here and, and damage other parts of my truck. What you want to do is you want to shoot the rockets, have them get deflected like into the ground or something, or just keep them away long enough until they run out of energy, you know, run out, run out of power, or out of fuel or whatever it is they have. I think it's just time based. But I don't know. with me. Oh no, that's not what I meant to do. Oof. Hey, 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 there's another one. Uh, oh no, I got stuck. What, what's wrong with this thing? Okay, there we go. What happened to it? Ah, that was a big piece. Yeah, no, there's one there. There it is. Hard to see sometimes. I mean, it is just a carrot, after all. So I did get a little bit of damage here and there. There's a few pieces of glass missing there. I may have actually done that, I don't remember. You know, part of that bar is missing, part of this is missing. Still have my wheels. Now, I'm just going to set this to two and a half seconds here. We'll make it five seconds total. The timer has to charge all the way up and then all the way down in order for it to fire one. So, start driving away a bit here and then let's go. This is probably going to be more interesting. Oh yeah, there's already another one up. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Get away from my truck. It's mine. This is starting to get a little serious. Who are you guys kidding? You can't catch me. I am way too good for you. Wise guys, huh?
more carrots. <laughs> Still see a new old friend. Oh. It's kind of hard to defend myself when I can't move. Oh, my switch is gone. I can't even turn it off now. So now I'm turning this down where they're going to pop out of here every two seconds. Get out of here. And here we go. This is already nerve-wracking. Bring it on, suckers! Oh wait, you're carrots, aren't you? The thing is, I can still drive away pretty fast from there. From, 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 oh, no! Oh! back over there and the front over here what's left of it and that was interesting let's see what happens when I really increase the uh, odds here let's take this down to one second 500 milliseconds okay it's one carrot per second now this is gonna be a serious one Gosh, look at all of them Millions and millions! Endless stream of carrots still getting there. They're running out of fuel, yeah. I gotta get way back over here. It'll actually be a challenge. <laughs> Y'all are the best players on my team. Stay away from me, evil carrots. Just gonna go straight back toward them and see what happens. Oh gosh, oh gosh! <laughs> I'll get you. I'll get you. I'll s if I can just get myself oriented right. <sighs> now, I just need to remember not to stray too far from the tower, and here we go. This is going to be interesting. It's not chaotic. Oh, gosh, oh, gosh, oh, gosh, oh, gosh, oh, gosh. Oh, no, 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 Oh, gosh, there's so many of them. I'm coming in from up there. plan for this to go. Wonder how this will go with only half a second delay between each one. This is going to be kind of nuts. But I'm going to turn the engine speed down like a couple of notches. Um, am I stuck on something? You've got to be kidding me. That is not two notches down on the engine. Let's put it right there and see what happens. Man, 
Man, that is a lot slower than it was before, and it's only one notch difference. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Insanity ensuing. Not gonna be able to get away from it this time. You have to, oh, my gun's gone. My gun is gone. My gun is totally gone. Oh, ouch, ouch. I'll try this one more time with that at one speed lower. But let's make it really insane. <laughs> All right. Now I'm really going to get it. Start driving away slowly, or as fast as I can go. And here we go. Every tick, there's a carrot. Oh, oh I missed the very first one. Are you kidding me? Nope. This is a lost cause for sure. So I'm going to leave the truck at the normal speed this time and see if I can actually get away. The normal speed is not really that much faster. Right, here we go. Rocket's coming. Every chance they get. Oh man, when you turn, they really start catching up. Chunk. Stay away. Stay away from my booty. Now if I go right straight toward them, I might outsmart a bunch of them. Nah, 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 no, 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 Now, I think it's time to try some different guns. I think I want to try the fast explosive spud gun. Right, let's put this one on here, connect it to the button. Okay, so this one I actually have to hit the button. Like, I think this is going to be absolutely ridiculous. I'm going to slow this thing back down a bit because uh, they're going to rip me apart. Now, let's go back to, uh, let's do like every four seconds. That shouldn't be too fast, right? <laughs> here we go. these things at all. Oh, I got that one. That was luck, right? Yeah, that was definitely luck. Okay. Yeah. Sound effects don't quite work for this one either. I think I'm too far away. Oh, I deflected that one get close enough to the ground, and they get close enough to the ground, then the explosion will just deflect them away. Nope, that was the wrong way. Wrong way! Mm. I meant to go the other way. over there for? Oh, but there's pieces over there. They're going for the pieces. Decoys. <laughs> Unintentional decoys. I'm surprised I'm actually getting any of them like this. trying to get away. Run away! Run away! Well, that was kind of fun. Let's try some, uh, let's try another gun. Powerful Impulse. I really don't think that would do very much, but you know what? Let, let's give it a try. Just for the people that are out there going, try the Impulse spot gun. Come on, you gotta try it. All right, now, how is this one working? Uh, wow, this is going to be bad. <laughs> 
Um, that one I saw disappear. Maybe it. Maybe I got it. Yeah, I, I just. I, I, I think I might have got that one. Yep, I, I'm definitely getting them. It's just. I really have to. to hit the button a lot. And it. It's getting difficult now. What a challenge. This is a challenge right here. Really hard to hit these guys. And the explosive spud minigun. Oh, yeah. This is going to get interesting. Bring it on, carrots. there and it didn't blow up or deflect or anything so this one doesn't actually do anything to them subnautica laser that sounds fun there's actually two of these let's see what the first one does or doesn't do all right and You hit the button one time and it fires this continuous stream of laser for like a few seconds in that direction and then explodes. And I don't think that is going to be what we need. Let's try number two. All right, and okay, yeah, this one's a continuous stream. Question is, will it actually hit these homing rockets? Mm. Oh, yep, I deflected that one. They do, in fact, work. It's just really hard to tell because there's so many particles where you're actually hitting at. Covers up the crosshair and everything. So far, the uh, Spud minigun has been my favorite. Pretty much tell where I'm shooting at, as long as my particles aren't turned up too high. Turned the particles up too high, and... and... Oh, this is getting interesting now. <laughs> no. My truck. We'll find your own. Now, there are uh, some other weapons from other mods that we could try. Uh, I did try this aircraft cannon once before. Um, all the other cannons along here are way too slow. I have tried uh, some of the rocket launchers uh, from other mods, and they explode, like, right here in front of me. So, those are not good to use. But this little aircraft cannon will actually hit them. All right, and I'll show you now. thing is also really accurate. But I can see what we're shooting at. Kind of. It doesn't deflect them that well. Here we go. They're still coming at me, eh? No, no, no. Me! 
But this is not helping the situation any. This is the other laser I was thinking of. If I can shoot them. Yeah, this thing's a lot more accurate, so it's actually harder to hit the carrots. They're just disappearing. So I must be getting rid of them. Instead of deflecting them, this one is actually destroying them. field and just keep them off of me. Let's just see here. Power, distance. Oh, okay, that's cool. Let's get this button again. And let's see what this does. Triggering carrots on. And the force field... Ah, did it... Did the force field do something? I, I don't know. No, I don't think the force field is working. Because they are just tearing me apart here. <laughs> uh, yeah. Force field, no work. What, what is this thing going around here? What, what is going on? Maybe it's pulling inward instead of outward. Yeah, there's parts sticking to it. Okay, let's truck back down. Take it off the lift. Put down the force of field. Put the force field right in the back here instead, I think. Okay. Distance. And max power. Okay, that's way too much. That's ridiculous. Let's talk about that far. Let's bring in some. Maybe a little more. It's going out of 50 blocks. Let's see if you carrots can get close to me now. I'm just going to back off and watch them try to come in and hope we'll get blown away. <laughs> the A. Whoa, that was close. Ooh. I didn't turn that one on. That was my problem a bit. Okay, set this to 50 like I had before. This to maximum power. Hook it up to the switch this time. Now, let's try this again. Come and get me, you stupid carrots. Or try to get me. And, yep, I don't think it's affecting them any, because that one came right in there. Oh, wait a minute, it is affecting them. Look, that one just can't quite get there. Oh, it took out the switch. I'll just put another switch on it right quick. Now we'll turn this up all the way. Yeah, that, that's, it's not affecting them at all. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And now, I'm going to die. If my computer doesn't first, that's more carrots than I wanted to eat. Uh, oh gosh, I'm gonna die. See you next time, and remember, I am Zerfus. Yeah, I was most definitely not going to make it through that. <laughs>